Making a snowboy is super easy, but creating a perfect snowboy is a little bit harder. And if you don't create the perfect snowboy, you won't get very many snowflake DIY crafting recipes. Hey guys, what's up? It's Phil back with another Animal Crossing New Horizons episode. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make the perfect snowboy, and we're getting started right now. During the winter months between December 11th and February 24th for the Northern Hemisphere, or June 11th through August 24th for the Southern Hemisphere, you'll be able to create snowboys using the snowballs found somewhere on your island. Do keep in mind that you'll only see snowballs to roll into snowboys once the ground is completely covered in snow. You can find snowballs in open areas on your island. They will always be on the same layer of your island and fairly close to each other. To make a snowboy, you have to push the two snowballs around, making them grow. And after growing above a certain size, you can roll the snowballs into each other to create a snowboy. As a little side tip, if you break the snowball by accident or drop it into the water, you can always respawn them by entering and exiting a building. You can make snowboys of various sizes of snowballs, but only a perfectly made snowboy will give you a seasonal DIY recipe. You will always get a recipe when you make a snowboy for the first time, regardless of whether you've made them correctly or not. However, the next time you attempt to make a snowboy, you will be judged by how you build him and not get a DIY recipe unless it's a perfect snowboy. In addition, a perfect snowboy will also give you a large snowflake every day until he melts. You'll need these to make the 15 DIY recipes that you can only get from the snowboy. And lastly, a snowboy will stick around for about four days while delivering a total of four large snowflakes, so be sure to talk to him every single day. So I want to show you the difference between a normal snowboy and a perfect snowboy. To make a basic or non-perfect snowboy, simply roll the two snowballs into each other while not being too concerned with the size of either of them. Once combined, they will build a snowboy and he'll more or less be for display. You won't receive any large snowflakes or DIY recipes except for the very first time that you build one. If your snowboy doesn't immediately congratulate you on making the perfect version, you may have gotten the sizes wrong. Don't sweat it though because you can simply hard quit the game and immediately try again, but be sure your game isn't auto-saving when you try to do that. For the perfect snowboy, you'll need to pay close attention to the size of the snowballs. It's recommended to create the first snowball with the height hitting right around the top of your character's eyes. The second snowball's height should be about the same height as the top of your character's ears. Now don't worry, you can tilt the camera to ensure the snowballs are approximately the same size. Here's the step-by-step -step instructions on what you've got to do to create the perfect snowboy. Step number one, you're going to take your two snowballs to an open area of your island. Step number two is that you'll roll one snowball back and forth until it's at the same height as the top of your character's eyes. Step number three is to roll this large snowball to where you want your snowboy to end up. It needs a little bit of space around it since you'll need to be able to talk to him, so just keep that in mind. Step number four is to roll the second snowball nearby until it's the same height as the top of your character's ears. Now remember you can tilt your camera to ensure the snowballs are approximately the same size. Step number five is to take the smaller snowball and roll it into the larger snowball to complete your snowboy. And then step number six, if the snowboy doesn't immediately congratulate you on making a perfect version of him, you may have gotten the sizes wrong. And if that does happen, then you can simply hard quit the game and immediately try again. But make sure that your game isn't auto-saving when you do that. So now that you know how to create the perfect snow boy, refer to my other video that will show you everything you need to know about all the snowflake DIY crafting recipes that you can get from him during the winter snow months. And if you already know how to do all that, then check out some of my other videos. And if you're new here, then don't forget to subscribe.